Yep, yeah, unless well, there's people up on the third. Uh, you can't really see it very well from other places. Now we don't get to listen to concrete work, we get to listen to steel work. I don't know what's louder. That's not more exciting. <laughs> yeah. Watch your feet. Where's the impact wrench? <laughs> Is that really what holds it in one spot, those little, those little screws? Well, I mean, and the bolts from other parts of the everywhere. Yeah, sure. And the other I-beams. I don't think it's held up by being finger tight at any point. I'm pretty sure of this. I mean, its own weight will hold it up pretty good. To the wind. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I wish that they would put that other thing on the other side. Well, they're going to put up the other supports soon, probably. Those aren't going to sit freestanding for very long. So I take it from looking at some drawings that, that maybe this, maybe the line of this is going to continue to the other I think side. It's not going to be this whole <laughs> area that gets incorporated. I think. But, like, this is it? This is it. So they'll extend this brickwork over. Yeah, yeah. based on what they cut out on that I mean, look at where the support sure. beams are. That makes sense. Yeah. So this will actually be just open. like it is. Yeah. We have a patio. Just you got to go through an emergency exit to get out there. Right. Yeah. yeah, I was just saying that they could actually put a zip line. Here's the moment of truth, people. <laughs> oh. Yeah, no, they are. That's it. It's freestanding. Now just to do that four more times. Timber. Yeah. Yes. Tighten those bolts really tight, guys. <laughs> <laughs> it does kind of. Thank <laughs> you.